What up, business? It's your boy IBS Kelso. Uh, I'm here with my reshade settings. Uh, the only thing is, you have to join my Discord in order to get it. So the link to my Discord is down in the description below. If you guys don't have Discord, I do feel sorry for you. But hey, that's where you're gonna be able to get the uh, reshade. I'm not gonna be able to put it inside the description. So yeah. Other than that, hope you guys hit the like button, subscribe button. You guys enjoy the reshade setting, and we're gonna go over it right now. So let's get right into it, baby. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully you guys went to my Discord and downloaded it. And if you have, then you've made it this far, and now you're ready to get the settings for it. It is the Her in MX HDR shaders. We're going to be running Radiant GI, right? Let me click on it. And then uh, it's going to be six samples, right? Kind of just copy, pause if you need to. I'll go over it. Uh, I really don't know what the rest of them are. I really haven't really touched them, but just pause as you need to down here. Um, the rest of it is kind of just default. I really haven't touched any much on Radiant. It's kind of just default. Vignet, uh, you kind of see what that does in the background. As you can kind of see, yeah. And see what it does in a little bit background. I feel like it's just perfect. You guys can also play with it. Just get my settings and then go from there. Uh, type is original. I feel like you're s something new. Try new. Oh, that's that's what new is. Yeah, I'm, I'm going with it too. TV United United Four. Yeah, you can see it's just it's a it's a whole bunch of stuff that you can get into, man. You can get really crazy with it. I might have to mess with this a little later, and we might end up having to make another reshade video. But Vignet's pretty crazy. Let's go with magical HDR. You can see kind of what that does in the background. Uh, yeah, so bang, magic HDR. I don't think I've really touched too much, but go ahead and pause if you need to, just in case if you want to uh, get anything crazy, but I feel like I haven't done anything insane. So yeah, um, boom. And then clarity, easy peasy. You can kind of see what that does. I guess you can see in the background, like it makes it a little bit more in depth. Clarity, we got clear clarity radius three four for offset. I really don't know what a lot of this stuff does. I feel like I was just messing around, but if you just pause and do that, and I feel like after you spin down, like all of this is kind of default. So I hope you know, like I haven't messed with any of this. Um, and then after that, basically just got the bloom. Like the bloom is like I don't know if you can see that as well. It just kind of makes it a little bit like instead of grayish, it gets you that little tone. But bloom is what you really need. It's the HDR bloom. The bloom is huge. Um, I do I now I did mess with this a lot I use the auto intensity des desaturation you guys can let me know down in the comment section if like your certain things that I could touch up on or you guys can make better and let me know if you guys do make anything better out of this would, I would love for feedback um, yeah extracting bright colors full a thousand um, bloom intensity I feel like it was point two six two point four I feel like I wasn't having too much bloom sensitivity all the way up bloom curve one point two five nine um, a lot of this stuff was like I'm not gonna touch too much. I didn't I didn't adjust um, And then when I scroll down, this is huge. It's gonna be the HDR HDR you want to click on max color brightness um, And then you I do point two zero. if you go too bright Let me show you if you go too bright You can just see like how bright it actually gets I feel like you don't need to get that because like this track probably is not the brightest but when you get on brighter tracks um, it, it, it's, You're gonna really see it. So I say mess with it. See what you like uh, 0.20 is perfect for me, so let me put that back down. And then I do have H Bloom application check marked. Uh, I adaption. I just have a regular 0.5 debugging normal view. Yeah, I don't even know what Bloom Bloom view. It doesn't even do anything. Heat map. Yeah, no. So just normal. That's what you want. Clarity. I don't really know too much. And then yeah, I don't have anything else downloaded or uh, clicked on. I feel like I could. Oh no, yeah, I do. I have colorfulness. Uh, good thing I went. So the colorfulness is huge. So if you, you see like how much colorfulness did, um, I feel like I can even get this even better. I might have to mess with this a little later, but um, yeah, definitely see color makes a huge uh, play in this. You don't need anything too crazy. Let me make sure I don't have anything else. No, I don't. Easy peasy. So hopefully you guys got those settings. Once again, I'll, go, I'll click on colorfulness one more time so you guys can pause maybe if you want to 0 0.96, 0 0.74. Um, but yeah, that's literally... Oh. That's literally my settings. That's what gets me to play this game. I feel like it's not the best race shade settings out there, but it's it's there for playing. I feel like my PC can run it. I have a 3070 Ti with i Core 7 processor, so it doesn't give me any struggles at all. I don't even know if I'm going the right way on this, but um, yeah. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it. This is the Lawrence Brother compound. I thought it was like a pretty bright map and bunch of different textures on there so yeah hope you guys enjoy it. it's your boy ibs kelso like i said i wouldn't make this video longer than it needed to be so i will definitely catch you guys in the absolute next one and hopefully this helped you out but yeah join my discord and over for and for it and uh, i'll let you guys go like and subscribe pop 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 peace